Seriously, guys? Ugh. This is what happens when you don't have enough money to make your movie right. Hi, my name is Steven DeGenero, and I'm directing a movie called Found Footage 3D. Found Footage 3D tells the story of a group of filmmakers who go out to a cabin in Central Texas to shoot the first 3D found footage horror movie and end up in a found footage horror movie when the evil entity from their film starts showing up in their behind the scenes footage. What Scream did for the slasher genre, that's what we aim to do for found footage. And, like Scream, we wanted to make something smart and funny that pointed out the ridiculous cliches of shitty found footage movies, while at the same time paid homage to the best of the genre by being scary as hell. Make no mistake, this is a horror movie, not a spoof. We shot the movie last summer at a ranch outside of Austin, Texas for 15 days. So far, I feel like we've been doing everything right. We got some really talented actors, some cool special effects, and a script that really pushes the genre in new directions. I spent two years working on this script, incorporating extensive notes from our producer, Kim Henkel, who many of you guys know as the uh, co-creator of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I mean, this is one of the guys that created Leatherface, for crying out loud. Doesn't quite have the same ring to it, does it? Speaking of the ring, there's a very fine line separating scary and cheesy. One bad effect, and you can kill the audience's suspension of disbelief. From the beginning, I wanted to use practical effects as much as possible and limit our use of CGI. For the gore effects in particular, it was very, very important to me to do it right. <laughs> if there's one thing that we as horror fans can agree on, no. it's that bad CGI gore no. is the worst thing that could possibly happen to no. anybody, ever. No one should ever have to look at shit like that. Unfortunately, sometimes things go wrong on set and you have no choice but to fix it with visual effects. We've got one shot in particular that's critical to the story and has to look absolutely perfect. So we've got our eye on a company called Hybride. These guys have worked on everything. Pacific Rim, The Hunger Games, Predators, Final Destination from Dusk Till Dawn, even Avatar. They're the, they're the best of the best. They're great at what they do and we know that this shot is gonna look freaking awesome. Unfortunately, freaking awesome in this case also means freaking expensive. As in, this one shot, to do it right, is gonna double our visual effects budget for the entire movie. Which is why we need your help. The bottom line is this. I wanna make sure that I honor all of the hard work that our amazing and talented cast and crew have done over the course of two years. I don't wanna miss out on a chance to make a truly kick-ass, scary movie because we ran out of money at the end of the... <coughs> the end of the process. Uh, I'm not asking for a handout, of course. We have some really cool stuff to give you guys if you contribute, uh, including some one-of-a-kind found footage 3D memorabilia, some really cool Texas Chainsaw stuff that uh, comes directly from Kim's personal stash, and of course, you know, T-shirts, DVDs, posters, that, all that <coughs> kind of stuff, the merchant <coughs> merchandise that make you the envy of <coughs> all your friends. <coughs> Please, don't let this happen to my movie, please. I'm begging you. 